Yeah, impressive. It's um, it looks a lot bigger from the inside than it does from the outside. To be fair, and um, obviously the final preparations for the for the pitch to be laid. It will be uh, once the pitch gets in and the posts get up, and we uh, it gets you know the last tidy up. Um, we're hopefully ready to go. You know, obviously I've been here a relatively short time, but. Um, Look, Edinburgh Rugby's been looking for a home for a long time and certainly we now have a permanent one. So um, our ground, uh, our pitch, um, our branding, our stadium. So now we're very much looking forward to, uh, look, one, getting it finished and getting here, in here to train. Um, and also when uh, the world allows us, we can uh, start selling tickets and get the place sold out and, and play in front of a, a sold out crowd. I think that the thing that makes stadiums is one, how you play and two, the supporters that come in it. So we've got to make um, this um, uh, our own fortress. You know, we've got a pretty good home record in the in the main stadium and we've got to try and continue that um, here. So um, like I say, we've just got to get obviously when COVID uh, is uh, under control and we can we can sell tickets and, and get crowds back in. Um, look forward to playing in front of our home crowd, sell out here at nearly 8,000 spectators and and um, keep building what we're doing at Edinburgh.